first, let's look at how to set up Apple CarPlay on your 2018 Plus Honda Goldwing. Step 1. Turn on your motorcycle's electrical system. You can start the motorcycle if necessary. Next, start your Bluetooth headset. You should now see an icon in the upper left hand corner of the screen indicating that the rider's headset is connected. It should have a number 1 inside. If it has a number 2, that's for the passenger headset. A rider headset must be paired and connected to the Goldwing before we can continue to set up and use Apple CarPlay. Make sure you're at the home page on your Goldwing audio system. If this is your first time to attempt to use Apple CarPlay, let's go down to the audio setting menu. Use the jog wheel to select general setting and hit enter. Use the jog wheel again to scroll all the way down below system information. If underneath system information it says iPod, Click the enter button again and it should switch to Apple CarPlay. This is the setting that needs to show up underneath the system information menu item. Now you can click the home button to go back to the home screen. Now you're ready to plug your iPhone into the cable that's connected to the USB connector inside the center pocket shown here. If you have an airbag model Goldwing, you'll connect this to the USB connector in your trunk. Connect it to your iPhone with the iPhone turned on and unlocked. Once you do that, you should be able to see the Apple CarPlay entry menu shown here and you can choose to enable CarPlay once or always enable whenever your iPhone is connected. Now I'm going to choose always enable and press enter. If you look on your iPhone you should see a message saying uh, asking you if you want to allow Apple CarPlay on the Goldwing while the phone is locked. I recommend that you click the allow button that way if the phone is locked in the center pocket you'll still have access to Apple CarPlay on your Goldwing. Once you have Apple CarPlay working, this is how you need to use it on a daily basis each time you ride your motorcycle. Before turning on any other accessories or plugging in your cell phone, make sure to turn on the Honda Goldwing ignition. It needs to be in the ACC mode or you can start the motorcycle. The next step is to turn on the rider headset. Confirm that the rider headset is connected to the Goldwing. You can usually tell this if you're getting audio signals through the headset. If not, turn the headset off and back on again. The last step, and it's very important that the last step is to plug your iPhone into the Goldwing through the USB connector. Once CarPlay is activated on your Goldwing, you will control it through the keypad on the left hand control unit. Now you'll notice that the left and right arrow keys really perform very little functionality. You can use these in a music app to go from one song to a previous song or the next song, but to go from one app on the screen to the next to select an app, you have to use the up and the down arrow keys. I realize that's not very intuitive, but that's how you navigate through the various apps. To open or activate a selected app on the screen, press the ENT button in the center or the enter key. To activate Siri, press and hold the voice control button on the left keypad. If you simply tap this button one time, it will invoke the Honda Goldwing audio system and not Siri. 
so make sure you press and hold the button for a couple of seconds to activate Siri. If you found this video helpful, please click the like button. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more helpful tips and trick videos.